so good morning student in this video i will be discussing how to find number of unpaired electrons so uh, you know that this topic is very very important for neat iit amset bitset and even for class 12th board exam so this is of the one of the most important topic and from which you are definitely going to get one question so keep this in mind student so generally they ask questions based on 3d series scandium titanium vanadium chromium manganese iron cobalt nickel copper zinc so let's see the first example so in the first example you will see that scandium has one electron in d so it has one unpaired electron now in the second example you will see that titanium has two unpaired electron in the third vanadium has three because 4s2 is filled so it has three unpaired in chromium you will find that 4s also has one unpaired and 3d has five unpaired to so total six unpaired electron is there in manganese you will see that there are five unpaired because 4s2 is filled so only d5 has five unpaired electron let's see iron so you will see that iron has 3d6 electron 3d6 doesn't mean that it has six unpaired it has four unpaired electron so if you see there are five orbitals in d subcell so first electron second third fourth fifth six so these are the only four unpaired so in iron there are four unpaired electron now coming to cobalt cobalt has d7 so it has three unpaired electron because 4s2 is filled now coming to nickel nickel has 3d8 4s2 is filled so 3d8 means two unpaired electron now copper has one unpaired electron in 4s1 and zinc has no unpaired electron zero unpaired electron so keep this in mind student and question based on uh, finding the unpaired electron of ions are also used from 3d series ions are also used from 3d series so that we will see